Good morning, Emperor Eagles. Happy Wednesday. Today, we're going to do something a little bit different. Today, we're going to do our assembly through a video. And I know Student Council is making a video. It's going to be attached to this one. But I wanted to go ahead today and read the names of all the people who won different awards um, for our campus for this month. And we're doing it for a couple of reasons. Um, one, we thought it was going to rain. And it's a beautiful day. So here we are. But I wanted to share some names with you and to celebrate you. And so I hope that your class will cheer you on if it is your month. And if it's not, remember that we're going to celebrate those who did win. And it might be our turn next time. Um, this month, we're looking at manners. And good manners are so very, very important. Adults love students with good manners. Adults love other adults with good manners. And students with good manners grow up to be adults with good manners. That's making sure to say please and thank you, excuse me. Something that I notice a lot is when you hold the door open for somebody else and not rushing through. I know a lot of times in the morning you're trying to get to the gate, trying to hurry up, but sometimes just stepping aside and letting a little one next to you go first, um, saying, oh, I'll get that and helping clean up the trash, even if it's not yours, that's having exceptional manners. When you get something, even if it's not your favorite thing in the world, you say thank you so very much. And um, manners is kind of like a receipt that you leave with someone. It's kind of telling them like, hey, I really appreciate what you did. And they'll remember that. Um, having good manners is just a great way to say thank you to someone for something that they did. So I, can, I challenge you to keep having good manners, even as you grow up and see um, when you hear of someone having good manners, take note of that and make sure that you are always showing great manners as well. So for this month, we're going to start in TK and in Ms. Wong's classroom, we have Aaron and George, congratulations. In Ms. Kochiyama's class, we have Liam, Timothy, and Benjamin. Good job. In Ms. Wong's class for special recognition, sorry, I missed the name, we have Dylan. Congratulations, Dylan. In Ms. Greep's class in kindergarten, we have Benson. Julianne and Micah. In Ms. Eschnauer's class, we have Hero, Zachary, Chloe, and Sayu. In Ms. Reed's class, we have Tara, Karina, Audrey, and Owen is a special recognition. Congratulations, friends. In first grade in Ms. Chow's class, we have Lisa, Kylie, and Electra, and our special recognition is Dylan. In Miss Keelan's class, we have Chloe, Jaden, Jake, and Jasmine. In Miss Glaw's class, we have Janice, Hayden, and Ashley. In Miss Hannon's class, we have Angela, Harrison, and Lydia. In Miss Sue's class, we have Camden, Camilla, and Joshua. In Miss Haynes's class, we have Lucas and Samuel and a special recognition to Logan. In Miss Laughlin's class, we have Riley, Caden, Josh, good job friends. In Miss Alvitri's class, we have Daya, Brayden, Allison, Talia, and special recognition to William. In Miss Medina's class, we have Benjamin, Leah, Brody, and special recognition to Madeline. In Miss Silva's class, we have Mia. We have Rebecca, Kevin. Good job, friends. In Miss Scanlon's class in the fourth grade, we have Alec, Adrian, Paulina, Zachary, 
And special recognition goes to Grace and Filiana. Good job. In Miss Greep's class in the fourth grade, we have Bailey, Noah, Ella, and special recognition is Joshua and Stella. In Miss Dimkich's class, we have Ariana, Constance, Logan, Dylan, and Chloe. In Miss Consonary's class, we have Aiden, Kaylee, Anna, Marvin, and special recognition to Gerard. In Miss Butler's class, we have Sharon, Nolan, Michael, Violet, and special recognition to DJ. In Miss Lucas's class, we have Yubo, Kelsey, Andrew, Katie, and special recognition to Evelyn. In Miss Naylor's class, we have Sydney, Yun Hao, Ellison, and Jerry. In Miss True's class, we have Joshua, Sadie, and Kaylee, with special recognition to Danny. In Miss Scanlon's class in the sixth grade, we have Vadik, Jacob, Allison, and special recognition to Faye. As I read these names, every single one of these students, I also would have noted as well. They say good morning in the in the morning time. They say goodbye. So many of them, when I say good morning, they say, good morning, Ms. Rudell, how are you? They ask a question back. They'll say, thank you when you hand them something. They'll open the door for you. They'll say, how can I help? They all show exceptional manners. I know you do too. It is just their turn to be recognized. The one thing about manners is that it's contagious. If you have it, the person next to you will too. So keep doing a great job, keeping leaders, and thank you for showing exceptional leadership in the area of manners. I do have a few more awards to read for this month. We also have for our PTA contest of reflections, we have some winners as well. And so we wanna celebrate these people as well. The reflections contest through our PTA is an amazing way to show your art, your music, your dance. And we have uh, several winners from our campus. So in the area of reflection in the primary level of dance choreography, an award of excellence was first place to Rachel Ma in Miss Reed's class. Congratulations, Rachel. In the category of visual arts, honorable mention and participation in third place is Madeline Moda in Miss Hannon's class. We have um, honorable mention Jerry in Miss Greep's class in kindergarten. Honorable or award of merit in um, from with Miss Wong's class is Grace. And an award of excellence, we have Liam in Miss Kochiyama's class. Good job, friends. I'm so very proud of you. Thank you for turning these in and participating in this contest. In the intermediate area, in the area of dance and choreography, we have an award of merit, Sabrina Lai, fifth grade, Miss Consonary. And the award of excellence goes to Claire in fifth grade, Miss Consonaries. Congratulations, you two. In the area of photography, an award of excellence in the fifth grade goes to Valentine. Good job, Valentine. In the area of visual arts, we have honorable mention, Blair Paulson in Miss Medina's class. And we have award of merit, Filiana in Miss Scanlon's class. And an award of excellence in the fifth grade, Burl. Good job. And um, in the area of literature, we have the award of excellence in the sixth grade goes to George Castro. I'm so incredibly proud of you guys for taking the extra time to participate in this contest. I love contests. They're great ways to show your extra work that you do, your drawing, your art, your reading. And I'm so very proud of you for taking those extra steps and participating in this PTA contest and for PTA supporting this contest as well and for all the work that went in. So we will have awards for you that are put into your teacher's boxes that they'll hand out to you today. I'm so incredibly proud of all of you. I hope you have an amazing day and I love you.